Joseph Bradley Varnum January 29, 1751 to September 21, 1821 was a U.S. politician of the Democratic Republican Party from Massachusetts. Biography <inaudible> 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 Joseph Bradley Varnum was born in Dracut, Massachusetts, in Middlesex County, on January 29, 1750 or 1751, to a farmer with little formal education. At the age of 18, he was commissioned captain by the Committee of Massachusetts Bay Colony, and in 1787 colonel by the Commonwealth of Massachusetts. He was made Brigadier General in 1802, and in 1805 Major General of the State Militia, holding the latter office at his death in 1821. After serving in the Massachusetts militia during the American Revolutionary War, Varnum helped to destroy the Shays insurrection before he was elected to the Massachusetts House of Representatives 1780 to 1785 and then the Massachusetts State Senate 1786 to 1795. He also served as a justice of the Massachusetts Court of Common Pleas and as chief justice of the Massachusetts Court of General Sessions. In 1794, Varnum was elected to the U.S. House of Representatives, where he served from March 4, 1795 until his resignation on June 29, 1811. During his last four years in the House, he served as its Speaker. Varnum was elected to the U.S. Senate in 1811 to fill the vacancy in the term. He became the only U.S. Senator from the Democratic-Republican Party in Massachusetts history. Varnum served as president pro tempore of the U.S. Senate from June 29, 1811 to March 3, 1817, during the 13th Congress. He was also the chair of the Senate Committee on Militia during the 14th Congress. After returning to Massachusetts in 1817, Varnum again served in the Massachusetts State Senate, until his death on September 21, 1821. Varnum died in Dracut, and is interred in Varnum Cemetery in that town. His brother was Major General James Mitchell Varnum who commanded the 1st Rhode Island Regiment from 1775 to 1777, served as a brigade commander at the Battle of Rhode Island and later served as the Major General in command of the Rhode Island Militia. <laughs> <laughs> Slavery Henry Wilson, in his History of Slavery, quotes Varnum in the debate on the bill for the government of the Mississippi Territory before the United States House of Representatives in March 1798 as having been very strong and outspoken in his opposition to Negro servitude. On March 3, 1805, Varnum submitted a Massachusetts proposition to amend the Constitution and abolish the slave trade. This proposition was tabled until 1807, when under Varnum's leadership the amendment moved through Congress and passed both houses on March 2, 1807. President Thomas Jefferson signed it into law on March 3, 1807. <laughs> Notes <laughs>